the fuck's going on everybody hope everyone's having a good day I'm certainly having an excellent day feeling productive got an email got an email my addiction to female muscles very interesting he says hi no joke your vids are great and interesting I've been watching your stuff since 2015 it's a long time about three years now holy shit he says here's my problem I have several social media accounts like on Facebook tumblr Instagram and from time to time Pornhub where I have been uploading material on a frequent basis which is related to muscular slash physically strong women like self-created video edits animated gifs pics and vids or photo manipulations of female bodybuilders and so on. In my case, it is very important that the women I depict on my pages are at least, in my perception, very feminine looking to me. I see. He says, I just love female muscles and strength and I'm not attracted to males whatsoever. That's one of those things that makes you go, it makes you go, hmm. One of those things that makes you go, yeah. <laughs> I'm just I'm fucking with you, man. Relax. Anyways, he says, creating and playing music is actually the most fulfilling activity I know, being 36 years old, but I keep coming back to focusing on women with exceptionally muscular physiques, and I am really sick of it at this point. Furthermore, I love going outside for exploring reasons, but this shit confines me on my own four walls. I actually perceive it as an addiction, and since you have made... Uh, your own experiences with being addicted, would you have some useful advice for me, your longtime fan? I actually believe I know who you are, man. Um, Fim Seps fan. I used to have this guy follow me on Instagram and whatnot, and uh, he used to post pictures of female bodybuilders. And look, man, hey, you're not the only one. I've actually seen a couple of documentaries. There, there, there's this, there's a show. It's actually a very interesting show. It's called Strange Sex. And on one of the episodes, there was a guy who, you know, you, know, you can call it a fetish or you can call it a, a sexual preference or an attraction or whatever. He had a strong attraction to female bodybuilders. And basically, he liked to um, feel, their, feel their bodies. And from what I remember, he, didn't, he wasn't even into, like, having sex with them. He was just into looking at them and to feeling their muscles. Now... That begs the question, does that make you gay? Well, I I would say not. I would say not simply because a female bodybuilder, you know, they're not they're not men. Um, but they do take steroids, so the, so 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 their facial features are are going to become more masculine. I'm sure that their voices would become deeper, their breasts would become smaller, or they'd be, be pectoral muscles and they're obviously they're their physiques are going to be very masculine looking. They're going to be very muscular. Now, I've made videos in the past where I've said that I like dicks. And I say that I, I've even said in the past that I prefer dicks, but I'm not gay. I only like it if it's on a transgender woman. Um, what do I have to say about that? Yeah, I mean, I did say that. I did say that. But I don't consider myself gay. I consider myself a guy who is pretty open. And I'm a trisexual, because I'll try just about anything. <laughs> and I have had sex with guys, and I've had sex with transgender women, but in all reality, when I feel a wet pussy, it makes my dick hard immediately, like my dick gets rock hard. In fact, I cream pied my woman twice last night. It was awesome. I cream pied this shit twice, dude. It was sweet. Um... So, I don't consider myself gay, but, but I have had sex with guys, and I have said in the past that I like dicks. And I have got, I, um, how should I put this? I, I felt badly about myself for that, to put it simply. Now, enough about me. Back, back to you, dude. I don't even know your name. Uh, I don't even know your name. I'll just call you dude. Listen, man. Here's, 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 here's what I have to say about, about you being into female bodybuilders. Now, first of all, I bet, I bet that female bodybuilders, most of them, wouldn't be into you. 
I'm going to go out on a limb here and say that if you're a female bodybuilder, chances are you're probably not into guys. That's that's my guess. So, is this fetish, is this attraction a, um, a satiable attraction? In other words, can 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 this desire be fulfilled? Will will a female bodybuilder actually want to be with you? Have ha, have you had sex with a female bodybuilder? Is another question, or is it just more like a pornographic fetish? <clears throat> is it more like a pornographic fetish? You know, there's a lot of times where we watch, and I'm just talking about everybody, where we watch porn, just for example, and in the moment when we're like jerking off or masturbating or whatever it is to that pornographic scene like 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 we think that's what we want in reality but when you're finished and you blow a sad fucking load all over yourself or the fucking keyboard you're like oh my god what the fuck was i watching i would never want that to be real oh my god what was i thinking but then but then five hours later you go right back to thinking about that dirty shit you were watching on pornhub that's kind of my point, man. So, the other thing is this, like, how many female bodybuilders are even attainable to you? How many female bodies are actually attainable to you? Now, if you had the chance, would you date a female bodybuilder? Would you want to have a maybe an intimate or sexual relationship with this person? This guy who emailed me, he thinks it's an addiction. Now, may maybe it is, because if you have several social me social media accounts such as Tumblr, what did he say, Facebook, Instagram, even on Pornhub, even on Pornhub, all dedicated to women with muscular physiques. Yes, that is clearly, a, it's, that's, I mean, that's definitely a fetish. Now, it only becomes an addiction, it, it becomes an addiction if you try to kick the habit if you try to stop being into what you're into and you can't in other words if you have a drinking problem and you decide you know what tonight I'm not gonna drink any alcohol but then 8 o'clock rolls around 9 o'clock rolls around you get that itch you're like man I just want to drink right now man okay wait wait tonight I'll drink but tomorrow I won't then you have a problem if you are unhappy with your attraction and you say, you know what, I'm going to delete all my social media accounts, I'm going to start looking at regular looking women with, you know, feminine physiques, and you can't, then it's an addiction or it's just what you like. Just like if you're a gay guy. You know, if you just, if you're always looking at dicks and balls and hairy buttholes, and then... <laughs> And you're looking at dudes with their fucking shirts off and whatever, and you're like, you know what, today I'm just, today I'm so done with penis, I'm done with asshole, <laughs> I'm gonna look at pussy now. And then, and then like, one day of looking at pussy, you're just like, oh my god, what was I thinking, I want cock. <laughs> you're definitely gay, man, I mean, or, yeah, I mean, that's what you like, dude, so... You can take two directions here, partner, and this goes for anybody who has some kind of fetish or whatever it is, there's two directions you could take. You can embrace what you like. You can embrace what you like. But it seems like what you like is only on is only like uh, on the internet. It's only through image or only through like porn or video or GIF files. Now, if in real life when you're actually around a female bodybuilder and you're not attracted then at that point it's it's some kind of strange fetish it's some kind of now, now i'm no like like expert here but it's some kind of like addiction or fetish or something like that but if in real life when you see a woman with a very like masculine muscular you know ripped physique and you get attract you're like you're attracted to her then it's it's just what you like dude it's just it's just what you like there's a difference man so like i said there's two roads to take you can you can accept the fact that this this female bodybuilder thing is kind of like just like like it's like a weird little fetish it, it i shouldn't say weird because then it makes you seem like you're a bad guy i i'm not saying you're a bad guy i'm sorry to say that what i mean is that it's 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 like a thing that you're just not okay with but in reality you're not into it or that's just what you're into and if that's really what you're into dude stop stop overthinking it man just that's what you're into partner um, but if you can't be in a happy relationship 
because you're obsessed with this then I don't know what to tell you man so I would think about that um anybody else that has that has an issue like this man you guys can shoot me an email man no joke striking at gmail.com bitches fuck Instagram y'all facebook.com slash no joke Howard and look man my advice to you would be to would be to stop 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 with this internet thing stop with your social media stop making posts stop making pictures and try to stop for a few days and focus on playing music focus on traveling focus on going outdoors and exploring and just take a few days away from the bodybuilder from the female bodybuilders and if you can absolutely not control yourself and you have to go back then just accept that that's what you're into or you need to go see a psychiatrist dude straight up and if you can go a few days without it and you're like ah you know what I'm kinda over it see about getting a girlfriend see about getting a boyfriend maybe you need to try having sex with a guy I'm just throwing that out there dude maybe deep down inside you 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 want a guy man I mean I maybe I'm wrong and if I'm wrong I'm sorry but I'm just throwing that out there and I don't think it's unreasonable it's not unreasonable for me to say that because you like a manly masculine physique so try that out man and if you don't like it then at least you can say you tried it dude that's my advice um anyways like I said if you guys want me to do an email on a problem you're having in your life man I got no problem with that y'all I love doing this shit man no joke striking at gmail.com bitches fuck Instagram www.facebook.com slash no joke coward all that is in the description box below I'm about to go get my dick wet peace